guys, this is my second paracord bracelet instruction video, and today we're going to be doing uh, Terrellabite. So, what we need to do is have a buckle, pliers, scissors, lighter, and your paracord right here. About eight feet. That's what I would say for this. Um, the wrist size we're going to be doing is eight inches. So, to start off, you take your lighter and melt these ends right here. Don't get this on yourself. The burning nylon, it doesn't feel very good. And burn the other side. Alright, stick them together. Take your pliers and squeeze them to make them kind of flat. Okay, as you can see that. And you always need to test it by pulling on it as hard as you can. <coughs> and if it breaks, then you need to do it again. If not, then congratulations. You did it right. Alright, so, um, take your buckle, and get the male end, and now we're going to put this through here. But that's not very easy to do since it's all burnt and hard and everything, so I take one of these ends, put it right there. Push it in through with the pliers. Which isn't always easy to do, believe me. Now that we have that, we pull it through. Now that you have that, take bring it back and pull these through it. Alright, now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to pull on one side and make it so it comes through like that. You you might have to watch this again to get it. But um it's so that this part isn't where this is going to be and it looks nicer. It just looks a lot nicer and you know. So put that up. put that on and take your other one put it on. take one of your ends and if you can see I've already melted that and squeezed it with the pliers so it's flat so I put it in through the top take the other one and do just the same Alright, so now that we've done that, um, take it up here, now take the, your left strand, and bring it under, and now you'll know that it automatically crosses over the other strand, so take that other strand, bring it back up, and right back through there. So, um, now what you do... Once I get this finished, you need to tighten it. Print right there and tighten it. Make sure it's really tight because it'll it'll help you get this looking nicer. You don't want loose. Loose is bad. It's not your friend. It's your enemy. So now you take your left one again and bring it over the first strand, under these two, and back over the last one. Alright, now you take your other one, and bring it under that one, and cross it over these loose ends of paracord, and bring it through. Now you can just bring that back up and tighten it again. 
and then you just tighten everything and make sure it's tight, like I said, because it'll make it nicer. Kind of pull on these. Make make sure that they're really tight. There we go. Now you take your left side again. Bring it over this, under those, and back over the last one. Under that, over these, crossing back over the one that went under and back through. And don't be afraid to pause this if you need you need to catch up. So now you can kind of see if that's getting started. So I'll pause this video and come back when I'm finished. All right, so we're about finished. Um, you just like I said, take it and you go under these. You just kind of stick it right through, but, yeah, um, so, I'm just gonna be finishing up on this one, and, um, I will show you how you finish these off, and actually finish them off in multiple ways, I'm just showing you one of the ways I use. Okay, so you'll notice you're going to have it tight and not going to be a lot of room. But just work through that, and if you have to, use your pliers to pull them through. Another thing you can do is if they're flat, trim them into a point. That really helps more than you would believe. And if it gets t kind of tangled and twisted, just don't worry about that. Un just untwist it and get it back. Alright, let's see if we can do one more, shall we? Right there. Oh, I think we're going to be able to make this. Like I said, flat, turn it into a point, helps more than you would believe. Right, let's see if we can get this work through here, shall we? Now we'll take this off, and this, like I said, if you have to use your pliers, you can. Nothing wrong with using pliers. Alright, got it through. There's that. Just put it back through. One more time. Right there. Almost got it through. There we go. We're just about finished. All we have to do is take it. Now this is the finishing move. Take this and put it right through here. And just push it through. And it finishes off your trilobite look. And now you can just uh, trim, trim them off right where they are. Try not to leave not a lot of extra space. Yeah, trim it off really short if you can. lighter so it's, it's flat and feels nice. Alright, now um, take it and flip it around. Try 
cut it off as short as you can right there. That's it. To take it away, melt it again. It just prevents it from burning everything else around it. Alright. And there's your finished Trilobite Paracord Bracelet. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Check out my friend's channel, Mason Emmert. Have a good day. Thank <laughs> you.